Hello and welcome. You may ask yourself, why come to Road City? Well, we are going to hopefully show you right now. We're on the beautiful island of Rhodes in Greece. This is a beach uh, to the right if you are at the tip of the island. And we're about to walk into Old Town, which Rhodes has a big, beautiful, fortified city. We're having a look at that right now. So just off that beach, we're walking into the fortification. On the left, you'll see a restaurant that my wife and I used to adore about three years ago when we were here. Uh, they still have very good prices. Uh, it's a lovely place to check out. Local beer, 180 there on the sign. Beautiful rooftop terrace up here with beautiful flowers. We would definitely want to check that out soon. And we're going to continue down this wooded path, which is actually a bit of a shortcut into the center. Okay, here we see a classic old Taberna. Uh, beautiful Greek little restaurant here in the center of the wooded path. And we're going to see uh, our first square here. This is one of the major squares. Uh, you might see some parrots here, just going to the right of the frame. Lovely restaurants. Um, they call this the Seahorse Fountain. <clears throat> uh, so you can find it on the map. Look for the Seahorse Fountain. Um, again, just beautiful little view of our one of our first main squares that we're encountering. Beautiful old trees here. And a lovely place to sit and have a coffee. I've been on a couple of these patios. <clears throat> Between the two squares, we'll see a little narrow shopping area. Everything you would need as a tourist. Little wine cellar here. Steps coming down from the castle. And the second main square. So lots of big famous restaurants. Nice places to sit outside. Uh, over to the left, we'll be walking up this little road here that we're just going out of the frame now. <clears throat> and again, just our tourist shops, lovely restaurants. <clears throat> sunny day here. We've had very nice sunny weather the past two months. This little side street we're going up here is indicative of many of the little streets that come off of the squares, the main squares. Again, cute little sh tourist shops. The buildings are close together. It helps keep the uh, direct sunlight from beaming down on you during the day. Uh, we are now walking towards a little place that we like to have a beer uh, called Hermes. Thought I'd point out this little rock bar. It's called Legends. I came here once, uh, but the music didn't start till around 11, 11.30. Might have been just late that night, but they did mention that usually it doesn't get going until around 10.30, so that would be more of a late evening thing, but the music is high quality. The band was excellent, loved it. About 30 feet away from that Legends Rock Bar, we see this little vegetarian place for any vegetarians coming to the island. Just go about uh, 30 feet up from Legends and you'll have some nice vegetarian options. We haven't checked it out yet, but we plan to. Called Tomaroti. So, open every day, it says, 10 to 10. Uh, and just next to that restaurant, we see this little discount supermarket. It's kind of good to know about. Uh, Old Town isn't expensive, but if you do want to get a cheap water, maybe some cheap snacks, uh, probably good to stay hydrated. So, uh, good to know that there's a little discount place. Maybe you have a hotel in the old town and you uh, want to buy some food for the room. It's an excellent option. And here we are at Hermes, one of our favorite places. We notice our big beer, $2. It's a selling point for me. Get the Pita Euros for two thirty. The owner Hermes is great, very friendly guy. Uh, I see my wife there with her hat and my fresh beer waiting for me. Hermes Grill House. Great prices here. You get a pizza and two beers or a pizza and two wine for about nine euro. This is a cute little bar just uh, next to it. They play some 
real cool music at night and you can just relax and listen to that this is an old mosque they still have friday prayers here uh see a fountain there people would wash their feet uh, before entering the mosque clean their hands a couple of restaurants next to hermes so um I don't know if you'll be able to see the prices here, but espressos, $2, nothing too expensive. Okay, so we are down on the marina now. Got the pilot boat there. That would help the bigger boats in and out of the harbor. And we have a lovely view of that marina from this restaurant here. <coughs> We've been here a couple times. Uh... I think it's called the Yacht Club now. You might want to check that, though. Uh, but you can sit on that lovely patio and uh, have a nice view. Uh, this harbor here is where the Colossus would be, uh, just standing out there across the bay area. Moving along, we've got uh, rent-a-boats, lots of them, every kind of size and shape. Uh, they go down to Lindos, uh, Lazy Day Cruises, Booze Cruises. We were offered a 30-minute uh, cruise yesterday while we were filming this, uh, just 10 euro. Normally it would have been 15, but uh, they were leaving in 10 minutes and said uh, that our price would be $10. <laughs> it's in front, and they overlook the harbor as well. Inside is... Uh, lovely restaurants too you'll see at the very end uh, of our part two of this series we're having dinner at a restaurant called Athena <clears throat> and uh, we had some lovely food there uh, those are the famous windmills you'll see uh, in a lot of paintings of Rhodus and again some of the nicer boats here this is kind of a malacan or a walkway along the um, the ocean front That's me waving to everybody. Okay, so we just passed the uh, end of that marina, and we're coming to the tip of the island. The beach is here. Uh, very lovely up on this part of the beach. Um, lots of shades of lounges to hang out on. Some kind of cool beach bars. They're kind of banging out some music right now. Quite enjoyable. Uh, there's also a high dive board out there in the in the sea a bit. Kids like to jump off of. Um, adults do. I think I will. Another one of our cool little bars. Uh, that's going to conclude the first part of our video. We do have a second part coming up. We're going to look at the casino and a couple other bars we like, uh, a couple other squares, a restaurant to eat in. So come on and check that out if you'd like. Uh, give us a subscribe if you want. We're going to be updating probably every 10 days. Uh, just interesting things about the island, restaurant reviews, and uh, some useful tips about the buses and transport and so forth. So keep checking us out, and we'll uh, see you in the next video.